we're here with the final stages of the construction, about 87.2% done with this new construction. You can see the exterior, not all the way done, but we got our porch built in with our railings. Finally went in yesterday, graded this yard. We brought the yard up some and planted it because we planted grass. We wanted this house to be out of the flood zone. This is a flood zone neighborhood, but what you can do when you build a house, you can raise it up high and the the land high enough to it would take you out of the flood zone. Let's take a look at the deck in the back, see what they're doing. Yeah, we've got the deck guys here, trimming out this. We got our handrails going up here. So now we can, we won't break our necks as we're walking up. Then you can see the new decking is in here. And I'm gonna throw this one in too. Brand new decking here. Take a look at the deck. So, This is the new deck area. We actually listed this house two weeks ago. We got two offers in the first 10 days. But the buyer that we went with wanted a bigger deck. So we're gonna be putting in a 16 by 12, 16 by 12 deck. It'll be real nice. Come out about right around here. They'll be able to entertain guests and enjoy their backyard. Let's see what's going on inside. You got that carpet with you, Ron? Uh, Mark has it. Okay. Here's our toilets. Here's, here's our, this is our plumbing trim. We got the, this will be for our kitchen. This is our faucet that's going in. That's going in. You see it's brushed nickel. And our toilets that are going into the bathroom. We always do a stainless steel appliance package. We got a new refrigerator, new dishwasher, and we gave them an upgraded gas stove. So everybody likes to cook with gas. It hasn't been installed yet, but hopefully it will go into there tomorrow. Anything new in here, Mom? Oh yeah, we got the flooring in. Remember our hardwood? We use this color here. That was very nice. It matches our granite real good there. Very, very good color matching scheme here. Here you can see here on the floor, see how it's going to match. It's going to look real smooth as it transitions into the floor top. Let's see what you got upstairs. And this is the treat here. We're finally getting the tile in to the master bathroom. Oh, yeah, we got the. What you laughing at, bro? We finally got the laundry. Flooring done. It's been forever. I don't know what happened to the tile, the tile guy here, but I promise we won't use these guys again. I don't know, not the ones that are here, but some other guys. The tile, this is our laundry room. The tile is in. We use the 12 by 24. It's a very nice touch. And this is the last big job we have to do. Mark, tell us what's going on in here if you don't mind. Um, we're just finalizing the tile work. Um, Hopefully we'll be done in the next day or two to start grouting. Not another week? No, no, not that far. We don't have a week to play with. <laughs> we don't? No. Okay. It's crunch time. So what do we call this design here that you selected here, Mark? Oh, this is a brick pattern, a stagger. You know, some people call it a brick pattern, some call it a stagger. Okay, I like it. Yeah. Come on in, Mark. Take a look at this bathroom shower here. Finally yeah. going in. I see you got the base toward in. Are we doing one decorative band around here, Mark? Or yeah, two? just one. So why did you not chose to use two here? I don't want to be too busy. Don't want to be too busy. Dear God. So you see here, they pour in the cement. Remember we had that membrane that went under the bottom that goes under there so there'd be no no water leakage going through the floor. Yeah, I don't know how they, they got it nice and... Yeah, put some grade on it. Go ahead, Mark. Oh, it's just grading towards the drain. Nice, okay. Sure, I have no stand in water. Good. So we got over here in the corner. You see, Mark, what you got in this wall here? Oh, it's just, just a little towel work around the jacuzzi tub. Looks good. Yeah. I'm going to make a change right there and put a metal strip around there so you don't see it. I think it looks nice, man. Okay. What do you think? Or did, what do you think it even matters? Whatever, whatever you want. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't a please. 
So we and you to... haven't you haven't beaten me up on a lot of things. So the little things that you do come, <laughs> I mean, it's more than I'm more than willing to make those sacrifices. So you know, dear God. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I told you the other day it's been a pleasure. <laughs> I'm easy to make money with. Yeah, Mark. yeah. I like to make yeah. money as soon as possible. So we got bull nose here, Mark. Mm -hmm. I'm just curious, why did you want to do the bull nose around here as well? Because two pieces of board nose worn each other, it just doesn't look right. Two pieces of board nose. We got this right here. This is not board nose, this is cut towel. I know, that's what I'm saying. Why wouldn't you put so, board nose as you can see, these board noses probably wasn't wide enough to even go there. Okay, because it was not wide enough. Yeah. We can always bring this out. This trim here out can come out, right? Nope, that's made into the window. This is the that's window. the window frame. Oh, yeah. wow. Oh, we thought that was trimmed. Yeah, that's the window frame. So, usually we like to have bull nose come across here, guys. What we're going to do is maybe put a shoulder strip under there to make it get that finish. Yeah, look, I think it would be nice, but yeah. the mark thing. So, we need to have it coming right back here so no water penetrates going down and eating up. Well, the water won't even get up here. We just got a tub. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's what I Yeah. Oh, my Lord. I thought it's going to be fixed. Okay. Uh. <laughs> I already got my guy be here. He told me he called me when, when the towel got finished. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I'm not even going to show us <laughs> what, what I just saw. We're going yeah. to take it to the next site. I uh, think my, my plumber um has been the guy for that. This is the third time. House in Portsmouth, we got to go over there and do a repair. Gotcha. Yeah. What happens sometimes, guys, is they don't cover up the tub, which I recommend. I mean, the morning you can do well, it. What me and him saw, it looked like somebody screwed it in too tight. Well, you don't even need to screw it in. You, yeah, they cover, you couldn't see it because remember the plastic was covering from when they sprayed the door rock or the walls of painting and stuff. Sometimes you get a crack in the tub sometimes, and Mark said he's got a guy that can fix that. So yeah. we'll get that straight. Yeah, we made that decision before he even put the towel. I called my towel, my tub guy, and he said he fixed it. He fix them all the time. Cool, okay. So. Alright, we'll go to the next site. Yep. Damn! Yeah! What?